Okay, the second example, the diagram showed the curve y equals x squared plus 2x and the line y equals minus x. Work out the array of the shaded region. So we have to find the shaded region. So first of all, we have to find the intersection point. So let me write the first equation. The first equation is y equal to x squared plus 2x. The second equation y equal to minus x. So, we need to solve the two equations simultaneously. So, x squared plus 2x equal to minus x. So, if I get everything in one side, we get x squared plus 2x plus x equal to 0. So, now uh, we are going to combine uh, like terms. So, x squared plus 3x equal to 0. So, take the common factor x x plus 3 equal to 0. So we have two solutions for this equation. So x will be 0, x equal to minus 3. So now, how, how, I can, uh, how can I find the y? To find the y, uh, I will substitute for x equal to 0 into the second equation. So y will be 0. When I substitute, uh, for x equal to minus 3 into the second equation, y will be 3. So they meet at points 0, 0 and minus 3, 3. Minus 3 and y coordinate 3. Okay, now I will write they meet at points 0, 0 and minus 3, 3. Okay, the second step now. Now I have to find the area of the triangle. Can you see we have the triangle, right triangle? So, area of a triangle, area of the triangle. The formula of the triangle, right triangle, base times height over 2. So, which in this case, base is 3 and the height is also the 3. So, over 2, which is the 9 over 2. So, the next step, the third step, I have to find the area all under the curve between the x minus 3 and minus 2. So let me write here area under the curve between x equal to minus 3 and x equal to minus 2. Now how can I find area? Uh, by using the integration. So from minus 3 to minus 2 we have the parabola. So of x square x squared plus 2x dx equal to now we get here now we have to take the integral of this equation so we get x cubed over 3 plus 2x squared over 2 integral uh, now we have already integrate this e equation so from the minus 3 and 2 to minus 2 now we plug in the upper limit into the equation so we get minus 2 cubed over 3 plus 2 times minus 2 squared over 2 taking brackets minus now we plug in the minus 3 our lower limit minus 3 into this into the equation so we get a minus 3 cubed over 3 plus 2 times minus 3 squared over 2. Now we are going to evaluate this expression. So minus 2 squared will be minus 8 over 3 plus those 2's are simplified so we get the plus 2 because of the even power. So minus uh, minus 27 over 3 plus those two's also this simplify so we get the 9 
So minus 8 plus 3 plus 4 minus. So it will be also minus 9 plus 9. So they cancel each other because of the opposite sign. So we get 3 times 4 uh, will be 12 over 3. So result will be 4 over 3. Okay. This is the an uh, area under the curve between x equal to minus 3 and x equal to minus 2. Now, the fourth step, the first step, now, I have to subtract the array of triangle from the array under the curve to find this region. So, now, let me write here A1, A1, okay? A1. So, area, area of shaded region above the x-axis. So, I defined as A1. So, A1 equal to area of a triangle 9 over 2 minus area under the curve 4 over 3. Okay, take the common denominator. So, it will be 20 7 minus 8 over 6, so 19, which is the 19 over 6. So, we, ha we have found the area of the shaded region above the x-axis. Can you see? Now, I will shade it here. Okay. So, now the fifth step fifth step. Now I will find the area of shaded region below below the x-axis. So below the x-axis here. So now I will shade with black pen. So this will uh, I will uh, define as A2. Okay, A2. So A2 equal to will you the integration from x minus 2. Can you see minus 2 to 0? So we have the integ uh, equation, quadratic equation to x dx. Now we are going to integrate this equation x cubed over 3 plus 2x squared over 2 taking brackets from the limits minus 2 and 0 now we will plug in the upper limit into this equation so we get to 0 plus 2 and we plug in the lower limit minus 2 into this equation so we get minus 2 cubed over 3 plus 2 times minus 2 squared over 2 so now we have to calculate this one uh, minus we have the minus sign here so minus 8 over 3 plus those twos are cancelled so we get plus 4 okay so it will be 3 times 2 4 3 times 4 12 minus 8 plus 12 over 3 so minus 4 over 3 can you see the negative value showed the area under the x-axis? Okay, now the final step, the sixth step, the final step, sixth step. Now I have to add these areas because the in the uh, example ask that we have to find all this shaded region. So the last step, area equal to A1 plus A2. So what's A1 below, uh, above the x, x axis? So 19 over 6 plus what is the below x axis? 4 over 3. Okay, take the common denominator. Now I will multiply by 2, the second fraction. So we get 19 over plus 8 over 6, so 20. Uh, 7 over uh, 6 yes now when we simplify 
by 3 we get 9 over 2 so this is the exact area between the line and the parabola